Hello again. Um, I'm here with Fab, Fab Games um, Gunnelly. How are you doing? I'm fine, thanks. Good. You've um, unfortunately been knocked out of the tournament there in top 12. How, how, how did you perform? We played, um, at the start we played quite well. Um, I don't know the names exactly, the team we played. We won 2-0, 2-0. Mm. And the next, I think, uh, was 3-1 actually, yeah. And yeah. the next time we played Epsilon, we got kind of unlucky on the dom because we won first tie by, I don't know how much it was, like 24. Yeah. Playker won, well, then got B off the break, and then we lost. And S and D, they, it wasn't close at all. We just choked S and D. And Blitz we lost by one point, so it was pretty close. So to go that close against the number one seed, you must yeah. have been fairly confident going to losers. Now you've been knocked out. I mean, who who, who knocked you out? And did, was it a close game? Actually, it was. Uh, we played against Checkmate. Yes. And the problem was, to be honest, they they were warmed up. Mm. Like they had a game before, and they we played strikes, and which just come down to to like individual gun skill mm. and yeah they played a lot of free form we went warmed up and we just got completely destroyed on the first map s and d next one was we were up 2-0 and f like they all always got the first blood had shotguns and like yeah. sovereign and yeah we could like we didn't take any round we just choked on the map and next time we played blitz we were played very well on this map won mm. by like four points or something and then we had octane dom and Went in the lead by eight points, and then the second side they got beat also straight away, and then we lost. Do you feel um, if the first map wasn't strike zone, something that you say is so important for individual players, do you think we would have had more of a chance in the first map? Yeah, I think so, to be honest, because it, if it would be like a map but like on long range, something like Octane or mm. something else, it might be it might went different. Yeah, uh, is that because your team like your team's got a bit more of a like, uh, Torres as an AR player and stuff? Is that um, like one of the maps your team's just not particularly good at, or is it just? literally because you went one well down. No, it's not that. Well, on strikes and we we're pretty well because obviously like Rush, me, Strick, Taurus, we, we all can play subs so it's, mm. it's not that but you all obviously has to be warmed up and they, I, th I don't know, I don't know, I don't even know them but mm. I think they, I assume they are a team like for a long time and that's what we've not been and the rotation wasn't like on point. Mm. So um, talking more about generally about Ghosts, um, since we moved on from Black Ops 2, we've lost CTF, we've lost Hardpoint. Do you miss those game types? Do you think Blitz is a good game type to add? Yeah, definitely. Blitz is a good game type, but to be honest, Domination, I don't like it. Because, like, you can also, against Checkmate, when we played, we outslayed them on Strike Zone, yeah. and we actually lost by 20 points. Yeah. We, had, we had, like, I don't know, like, way more kills on one side. I don't know what it was, though. Yeah. And we still lost, so it it comes. It's not coming down to old slaying. It just comes down to how you play as a team and how you push and how you jump the flags. So yeah, I do miss capture the flag or hard point because mm. it was like hard point was my favorite game top. Yeah, yeah, I miss them. But blitz is all right. Yeah, it seems like a lot of people miss um, miss hard point especially. Um, it's made the game type. I think people say the skill gap on this game is a lot closer. Do you think that's because of the game types? Yeah, it is. It is. It actually is because like on domination, it doesn't come. Like not always comes down to if you, like you don't have to all outgun everyone. It mm. just come how you stand, how you position yourself, yeah. and how you push as a team. It just comes down to that. So it's it's true what you just said. Yeah. yeah. You also see that on blitz. You see um, the choice of when to engage someone can make a big difference. So sometimes people just sneak past rather than make themselves known and get the cat there. Yeah. Um, you came in with the ape seed. You finished like in the, the top twelve, like eight to twelve bracket. Do you feel like it was a fair seed? Uh, are you happy with matching your, like that placement? No. Obviously no. I feel like we could do way better if we had like a bit more practice, a bit more time, because we like play two weeks or something. I think we could do way better. Eight seed is yeah, all right, but to be honest, I expected us to do better. But I didn't like. I don't think like that's the. We didn't play to our fullest, so yeah. Okay. Well, thank you very much for the interview. We're going to be heading over to the caster's desk, where I believe Sims got another interview with a lightning.